What's up guys and welcome back. I'm Nitro Wolf and in today's video our survivor's story continues. Last time we spawned in, established a decent start, and found a good place to start a base. Today we continue the story and begin the fortification of our base. Don't forget if you liked the video hit that like button and subscribe to the channel for more Project Zomboid content and much more. Alright guys let's get into it. Oh, it's snowing? I'm not gonna lie, this is the first time I've played in snow. Let me turn my alarm off because it is not 5.30. I've never played in snow in this game. This is the first. On day one. Also, it's because my settings are at April. It's April right now. Switched it up a little bit. Okay. Let's see what we got. Get my. I want to drop this pitchfork and have a crowbar in one of my things. Crowbar out. I want to clear up some backpack space. Don't need ammo. Don't need all these books. Don't need this rifle. Lighten my load before I work my man out. Work my mans. Alright. About to come back for these books. Okay, start off with some burpees. 10 minutes. Quick rest. And then sit up. 10 minutes. But honestly, imagine doing sit ups for just 10 minutes. Who, who does sit ups and doesn't go to a specific number? It's very confusing. All right, satisfy this hunger. Hmm. Oh, I can't open, can't open the peaches. So I guess we're having tuna for breakfast. The breakfast of champions. I should also find a hoodie. sleeve t-shirt that works too smoke cigarette <laughs> there shouldn't be much snow on the ground right <laughs> I'm gonna go into the post office. And why does it look like that light's still on? I'm gonna start clearing all the useless stuff out of there. Start working on my carpentry. <laughs> all good, bro. I understand. Trust me, I know all about that puppy life. I know all about that puppy life, dude. Okay, so I do have some carpentry books. Find my first carpentry book right there. 
and I hear people on the outside, so I'm going to clear them first, and then we're going to read the, the book. What kind of puppy you have? So I have multi hit on assault. Honestly, multi hit only works with two handed weapons, so I feel like it's like kind of realistic. So that's that's why I keep it on. Like that's pretty realistic. I'd be able to hit two unintelligent beings with a baseball bat at the same time. guys have loot. And finish these guys off and then... <laughs> yeah, I've got a, a German Shepherd. She's like... She's big and dumpy. She also doesn't understand how big she is. First German Shepherd, she's the wear. Second one. Not quite. Alright, clear this alley. I will eventually cover this motel and clear this stuff out. Holy crap. Where all these dudes come from? Honestly, I should probably rest, but we're gonna send it. This baseball bag is about to break, too. Take his pants. Those are some nice pants you have. Let me wear them. Honestly. I wish I lived like a hundred years in the future, but like video games were so advanced that it's literally a simulation and we're playing freaking Project Zomboid build 45. First person VR. Alternate, no, it's it'd be called uh, a, a VR alternate virtual reality or some shit, dude. Hey, I need to get wood now. That's what she said. Put this bad boy on. 
gonna fast forward and read all day. I mean, think about it, bro. We're on a rock. We're on a rock that is perfectly positioned away from the sun in a way that, like, we survive. The moon is in perfect position to where our, it keeps the gravity in check. And we're just floating in nothing. And all the stars we see are exploding suns. Like, that's insane. <laughs> or so they say. What if the stars are just the cameras? So that they can keep their eyes on us. Mystery. Like, what are the odds of that? And when the freaking fun fact, the same little thing that evolved into a wolf evolved into a dolphin so where's the thing that on land evolved into humans did that evolve in the human the under the water version of humans because there's oxygen underwater dude the mysteries of life with nitro <laughs> What if we, what if we were the ones that destroyed the dinosaurs so that we had a planet to live on? I need to go find some food. Drop the book. I guess some bread. Okay, now. I cleared out stuff in the post office that I don't need. Because I'm going to board up all the windows. This is peak Zomboid content. See? Okay. Yes, that, that, but also, why do we have civilizations many, many years apart that all use pyramids? I'm just going to start tearing up doors. Many, many years apart. They all design pyramids. They all use them for places of worship. Hello, destroy the door. Thank you. Clearing out the hotel is going to be a lot more beneficial. Oh, 
don't know, dude. Life's weird. Should probably grab that eraser out. I don't know if the game's still weird about the pencils not working. Oh, frick. I only just... <laughs> I only did half the desk, what the heck? I don't even have enough wood to... board up one window. It's a sad day. What if AI was brought to us by aliens? Because where did AI come from? It just popped up. <laughs> Okay, that's all the bottom floor pretty much, and I got like nothing out of it. I'm in pain. Yeah, but like we're, we, you know, humans, we're gonna eventually freaking want it to be self learning and then it's gonna teach itself stuff and then it's gonna know everything. It's gonna be able to scour the internet and just know stuff. Desks. What if aliens are actually just like an advanced form of robots? And they need, and they need humans to make them smart again, you know, to like make them like functional. And we just don't know it yet. Like we're here to make them to make AI better. For now, we for now we place the information. But what happens when the AI is able to do it itself? Okay, this should be the last freaking desk in this building. Holy crap. Besides these ones. I need to find a sledgehammer so I can build a doorway to the roof and build my rooftop garden. That's 
my plan. It's top garden. planks all five planks that I made and that's like see like that's how like math if you look at math, like scientifically, it's it like lines up with the universe. Like the universe is exactly is like mathematical. It's really weird. Like oh, it's called hexagon. Just he hexa something, or like everything's like a hexagon or some shit like that. I don't know. I'm not sure. I've heard some, I've seen it on like uh, Joe Rogan, some shit. Which, I mean, that doesn't really count, but it's something like that. <laughs> I'm just going to go ahead and drop this baseball bat outside. Getting a tad weepy. <laughs> How many planks do I have? Six. Yeah, those are big words, but I don't know. Man, big words overcomplicate it. Oh, I don't have enough nails. Son of bitch. Thirty-six zombie kills. Tuna for dinner. Tuna for breakfast. Tuna for dinner. I wonder what's on the menu tomorrow. Possibly tuna. Wait, you didn't grab the body. What? Hey, 
840. Probably, oh, nothing very far. Check you tonight. All right. All right. Back to the house. Grab carpet too. And drop the baseball bat. It's pretty much broken. I'm gonna grab the. Uh, uh, wait, where did I put the cr crowbar? <laughs> Carpentry 2. Get to read for like an hour. Go to bed. And continue working on my base, I suppose. Not even work on my base, I'm just boarding up windows. So it's not even anything crazy. Read. Finish the day up with a little knowledge. Some carpentry too. And 10 o'clock. That will complete day two. We will hit the hay with the alarm clock for 5.30. I'm going to have to go get some coffee after this, though. All right when it loads up, right before I start my day. I will get coffee. So... Today's mission Continue my carpentry So let's go ahead and read this Get our out in for the day 10 minutes of burpees Rest. Ten minutes of setups. Quick rest. Right. Carpentry level two. Let's get this reading. Until nine o'clock, because holy crap, he's taking forever. Solid. All right, cool. Good enough. Holy fog. All right, well, I guess it's time to clear out the, um, I can't think of words right now. We're clearing out the hotel. Motel. Holiday Inn. world empty it all out while I'm here wait 
it's easier to come through and disassemble it all. Honestly, if I got a sledgehammer, I would totally knock out all the walls and just turn this into a huge storage facility. Future plans? Maybe. Fucking broke something. Where you at, brother? Here. Hmm, I wonder where he's at. He had a key though. Okay, this side's clear. I'm gonna go ahead and just start disassembling. Pretty much disassemble everything but the outside doors.
Julia, thank you for the follow, dude. Welcome, welcome. How are you doing today? Oh, yeah, now I'm uh, disassembling so that I can get. I'm working on uh, planks for my windows. Secure in my base. Or at least starting to secure my base. At least a little bit better than what it is. At least one of the not have. I would have more than glass between me and them, you know. It's stopped. I'm scared. And I'm eventually to turn this into a uh, storage area, probably. Yo, Dexter Six for follow, dude. Uh, honestly, I'm doing some YouTube content right now. My Zomboid is my my YouTube stuff. But I will definitely be looking. Oh, I thought it would be done disassembling. We'll be look maybe looking for a server when the next big update comes out. I'll probably put a lot more time into it other than strictly YouTube or more YouTube time. Yeah, dude. If you want to do that. I mean, I... If you're offering... I'm not looking to buy or anything, but... If you're trying to do it for free... You're pretty sick. Yeah, I'm down for that. I know, I know the grind, dude. You don't seem like a bot right now. I don't think you're just trying to sell me shit. I know how them, uh... Twitch bots be, but you don't seem like a Twitch bot, so... Or a kick, 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 Twitch, same thing. Same shit. Give you a theme. Hmm.
gonna take this date. <laughs> I don't know, dude. Surprise me. Oh, I fuck. I need to find water. Water. Base building takes a while, dude. Base building is a grind. My main game, um, Rocket League, I suppose. It just, it's, a, it depends. I'm very, very weird gamer. Like I, I, I main one game until another game that I also main like updates like I, I also do a lot of Tarkov I do not know I could disassemble these little fridges just did okay, I feel like this is enough blank but I also only have one more room left so I'm just gonna finish it up and that should be enough plank Well, let's go with techno. Let's go with techno, dude. Like some synth wave. Yeah. Bang. Are you, uh... Are you, like, in school for, uh, music production or something? Right now, I pick up all these planks. All right, dude. Get the news. Oh, shit, that's awesome, dude. Oh yeah, dude. There's a lot of a lot of money in the uh, making shit for streamers, especially when like all of the copyright and stuff. Because I know Twitch kicked cracked down on that a while back. Ooh, I'm hungry. Hungry. I also have to make commands for kick. I haven't messed around with it. Has this window been unboarded the whole time? Barricade the shit. Alright, I need nails. I think I grabbed a ton of nails. There we go. I was gonna say, I know I have a bunch of nails. Found a couple packs of nails. Also need to keep track of my planks I have.
get some more planks. I can probably walk now. I think I cleared the area good enough. Never mind. God damn, just as soon as I say that. I don't know where that dude came from. Zomboid be like. <laughs> oh, I think I'm in the clear. Random dude making no noise. Pops out of nowhere. These last two days of base building and one video. It's all good, all good. So heavy. Why am I so heavy? It's just weak, apparently. Oh, yeah, he can only hold 11. Jesus. Brother, would you like to lift some weights? I'm gonna die because this dude's frail. Break your legs from carrying too much. I've never had that. I've never had a character this week. Oh, so, well, I hope that don't happen. I know I can get injured. I don't know if I can actually break my legs. That's depressing. Usually I put it. Usually I can carry like 15. I don't know. This, this must have put on a different, like a weak trait or something. Not 100% sure. Because actually, I'm gonna take all this shit out of my bag. found this book yet mod i accidentally hit q are you kidding me this freaking have you found this book yet mod is a lifesaver i used to have to keep, run around with a notebook and freaking pipe in every book i found 
the old school way. Old school zomboid, dude. These is found. Okay. Now all these books I should have. Just dump them on the floor. I don't want to build a medium basement, so put that on the floor. And now I'm going to transfer all this stuff. For temporary. So I can finish without breaking my legs. Because I'm weak. Rest up a little bit. Right, still got like two, three hours. More than enough time. I only need to do like one, two, three more windows or something. Yeah, I need to get quick on my carpentry because I need to build the water collectors and shit before the water goes out. That would not be good. I'd survive. But it would not be fun. planks that's enough for three windows dang it should be done I have to get that body out of here too <laughs> oops eventually get around to like boarding up the outsides too but
Well, that don't seem right. Went through a whole box of nails on like five windows. Oh, I put the rest. Okay, never mind. That makes sense. I was about to say, I was like, I don't think I did. I might play some Halo after this. Alright, seven planks. Do this window. And I think that's the last window. Downstairs, that's the only one that really matters. Basically secure. Turn off all the lights on the outside. Music sounds like there's somebody knocking on something. Alright, lights off outside. We're gonna here grab another thing up high. And then on the next day, we start surviving. Next day, we start surviving. I'll probably end up securing this house this would be like my backup house or something I don't know something gave me an error something's giving me errors Not sure what it is though. So whenever I right click, okay. Well, this day is complete. All right guys, that wraps up today's video. As always, thank you for watching. If you liked the video, hit that like button, show some love, subscribe to the channel. I'll see you next time.